what is the acceptable rental yield in Metro Manila, in Marikina? Okay, first, kung nasaan siya, irregardless. The strategy is always, where can you put your money? For example, the bank is always the reference, diba? The bank gives you a 1%, 2%, 3% return on time deposit. That will be your reference point. If a property comes to you at ang return niya ay 3%, oh, no. ibilin ba natin? If you are a not so experienced property investor, pwedeng kunin mo yung sa bank. It's okay. You just put your money in the bank. It will earn 3%. Same lang sa property. Wala ka pang kailangan i-worry. If you're medyo professional and you know how the property market works, I will buy the property and get the 3%. Because I know that 3%, if development comes, can be 4%, it can be 5%, it can be 6%. Aside from the rental, what if nag-appreciate yung property? Let's say you're gonna buy a house and lot in Marikina and Kainta. Let's say nag-appreciate. Tumaas yung value ng lupa. Tumaas yung value ng construction material. Then, your 5 million here, and your 5 million here, this will become 8 million. Pero yung nasa banko mo will only be still 5 million. 